Hello indie game lovers, it's Slushy here. Today we're going to have a look at Treasure of the Abandoned City. This is the latest chapter in the Tales of the Renegade Sector episodic series release of top-down shooter action-adventure games. Now in these games you play spy uh, Spice Girl. Scary Spice? You play Space Pirate Captain McCallery, I believe it is. And if you don't, like, if you want to get in on the story, it doesn't matter, each game's actually a standalone kind of release. But if you go to the Renegade Sector website, you can download some of the earlier ones and play them for free. Captain's Log Laserbeard's treasure map has now brought us to the planet Seltan. The treasure apparently lies in the castle of the ancient abandoned city of Talamil. The city is nested at the heart of a network of canyons. Knowing how Laserbeard hid his treasure, I doubt it will be just as easy as strolling into the castle and grabbing the loot. WASD mouse space QEP. Alright. So the first thing I want to say about this is I really like the art style. I actually watched the artist Todd Luke streaming it on Twitch TV. And I really like what he's done with a limited palette. It's got that kind of Zelda Link to the Past almost vibe. To me anyway. So who's this guy? Hey Mark, why do you always have to airdrop all the ammo onto the planet? Why can't you just give it to me like a fucking normal human being? If I gave you all your ammo now, you'd just waste it. You've got to earn it. But here's what I'll do. You know you can barely throw a punch. Hey. Well, I recently came into possession of a hyper glove. Not only will it make your punch more effective, but it will also help you carry heavy objects. Quiet hyper glove. Okay, so we can pick stuff up now. And throw it. <laughs> In Mark's face. That's for scattering my ammo around. Just give it to me like a normal person. Who's this? Robot. I love having sand in my joints. My movements were way too smooth anyway. I like that. Why did your people create a sarcastic robot? Warfare. <laughs> a bunch of sarcastic robots at war, that'd be awesome. Help, I've forgotten how to use my legs. Seriously? Just now? Or was it before you walked over here? You do remember that you can sprint short distances by holding shift, right? Okay, and that you can jump over short distances by walking towards a pit. And that you can press up against cover? What else can I do? Okay, that's it. Good. I should have used the robot voice, but it would have been horrible. It would have been like, You know, you can use cover. It would have been horrible. So what's going on up here? Is this a pit? Uh, looks like a cave entrance almost. What can we do with this block? Can we pick it up? Too heavy. Oh, hang on, I wasn't even using my glove, I don't think. No, too heavy. Give me something to punch. I like that punch. Whee! Might be hard to use though. Sorry guy, I didn't mean to punch him. Greetings, Captain. This planet is quite fascinating. The abandoned city is just north of here, through that canyon. Here, take this portable translator, which I've programmed with ancient Sultan. It will allow you to read any text you may find. Tell me about the abandoned city. Tell me about the plant life. Here we go. These blue plants are safe to eat and will heal you. Some of the other plants will impart positive benefits, but be warned. They have side effects, including hallucinations. Not that that stopped you in the past. Oh, so he's a bit of a wild one, McCallery. That's good to know. Help, I've forgotten how to eat. I've taken too many hallucinatory drugs. You can pick up food items by walking up to them and pressing E. Oh, I forgot. What accent does he have again? Um, then press space to open your inventory. You can... Use the WASD keys or the mouse to select, and E or the left mouse to consume. Alright, tell me about the abandoned city. Oh, wrong button, idiot. During the pre-discovery times, it was common on this planet for nobles of a certain standing to take a band of travelers and found a new city. Many of the settlements were successful in, like, the city of Taraka to the south. I was gonna give him a list, but, eh. But others run into problems, and for one reason or another, were abandoned. If you find any ancient text, I would be happy to translate for you, and it would help us to learn more about the downfall of this city. Okay. Goodbye, my friend. I'm gonna pick these plants. Pick up blue fruit. I hope this tastes better than blue waffles. Well, they can be quite tasty. So, we wanna go up this way, I believe. I hope I haven't already missed something. I wouldn't be surprised. It's a checkpoint. I thought it was going to be like a teleporter or something. Oh no, the music's gotten a bit more dramatic. I think there's going to be some action. Maybe I should get my gun ready. 
Get into cover. Run to cover. He can't see me, right? Oh shit, he can jump cover? Fuck, he's invulnerable as a ball. Die, you piece of shit. Okay. Oh, he can pick his corpse up. I like that. I encourage developers to have more corpse interactions. That sounds kind of disgusting, doesn't it? It's pretty satisfying playing with the corpse of your dead foe. <laughs> I like that. Good sound effects. Good music as well, actually. I'm digging this tune. Okay, we can't go up there. I don't think we can pick these blocks up yet. We can punch them, but it doesn't do anything, I don't think. No. So that's almost like having Metroidvania elements to the gameplay, I guess. What are they? What's that thing I really. Oh! Damn it. Quick, quick! I'm, I'm over here, man. Um, oh, he's hiding my uncover, eh? Two can play that game. Gotcha. I really want to get up there. What's, what, I'm not sure what that is, but it looks good. It's shiny and shit. Oh man, that guy's got anger management issues, throwing rocks. Random passes by. Yeah, welcome to the planet. Thanks. These aren't stairs, are they? I don't think so. Hmm. I probably should use my sprint. Go, go. Oh, there's a plant. I want to get it. Oh shit. Yep. That music's awesome. So tense. Did I miss something? I probably missed something. Why do I keep thinking I missed something? Okay. Oh. Oh. That's really bad. Just get the fuck out of there. I should eat that fruit I got, actually. Damn, this is looking bad already. Three health. It's only this early into the game. Run. Ah. Damn it. <laughs> One health. That's a checkpoint. Okay, I need to get. I need to collect those triangles and put them in here. How do I get to them? Ah, oh, I bet you I miss them. Oh, well, hopefully I can find other things that are just as interesting. Find a way to get some of the keys anyway. Nope, not that way. Those blocks are pissing me off. I wonder if you can shoot them. You can, but it doesn't do anything. Oh, this way doesn't look precarious at all. Go. Quickly. Oh, shit. Down to one health. Oh, no, no. No! <laughs> Bastard, let's go left. So it looks like it might be a little bit of a tricky game. I'll probably just crap at it. I'll get better. It's only the first six minutes. What do you expect from me, people? Oh, I just wasted ammo, didn't I? Oh, now shit, now I do need my gun out. Get your gun out! Okay, pick these plants. I'm gonna be eating that shit real soon. As soon as I dispatch of this motherfucker. Okay. Hmm. I wanna find some other plants, maybe. Nope, not going up there. Oh shit, he's coming for me. Dude, I'm just a botanist. Honestly, I'm not coming to steal your national treasure. No ammo, fuck. <laughs> ah shit, motherfucker, shit. Checkpoint, do I really want to save? Maybe I should. Oh, I saw a yellow plant. Oh, did I go past one of them before? Shit balls, motherfucker! Oh, what? Where did you come from? I thought you were just a fucking skull. <laughs> Get out of here! Oh, what's your shit? Got some ammo. Gotta get one of these elusive triangles. At least one, right? Oh no! Oh, not fair! Look at the size of what he's throwing. Oh, his head came off. <laughs> oh, 
chunk. Can't throw it because I can. You can break it. Oh, what's this? Is that a switch or something? Maybe not. What am I doing? I'm lost! <laughs> no, I like this game though. I'm pretty sure I'm not in the right area right now though. Oh, you motherfuckers. Just a botanist. Picked up spiky fruit, what's that to? Lose one HP, two times toughness. Hmm. Can't really afford to lose one HP at the moment. Get your stupid head out of the way. Okay guys, well I hope you enjoyed this brief look at Treasure of the Abandoned City. Hope it piqued your interest to go check out the other games in the series as well. Looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. I'm enjoying it. But this is probably enough Let's Derpin for one day, huh? Alright guys, I'll catch you, uh, shit. Catch you later. Thanks for watching, stay tuned for more indie game previews. Have fun, bye. Are you kidding me? How did I not see that? Ah, oh, damn, it's so easy to find. Oh god, this was so fucking obvious. I missed this as well. Ah, oh, there's a yellow plant. Damn it, I wanna try that. Why didn't I find that in the video? Oh, that looks killer. So trippy. This is just like 1999 for me. Whoa. Whoa. Seizure. Warning.